Hello and welcome to Zekromo3 TV. This is the 2024 CCS season opener. Mr. Here at Pocono, are you the York Parent Patties 400? And we got some new faces, new, um, new rookies. I won't go into all that. We'll go through that, that throughout the race in the season. You'll get comfortable with it. Uh, we got a uh, Dark X Ray in the business with us and David Don. Uh, he's new. Uh, I'll just say hi. If Hello. You um, I don't really got much else to say. Uh, if y'all want to go ahead and uh, go through y'all's first thoughts. Uh, don't have any, that is. Nah, I don't know. I can't well, it is pretty much one of the crown jewels to start the season, after all. As for Pocono being the first race, my understanding, people are not too happy about it, but we'll see how it goes. Yeah, I'm testing the waters. If it's bad, we'll change it. It's just like well, there's... stereotypical, like Daytona is usually the first star race. I kind of want to switch it up, see how it goes. If it's bad, we'll change it back. There's fans who showed up. There's a camper with a Jeff Gordon thing. Also, a little note here: uh, uh, Jet 64. We have two part-time drivers in this field. Jet 64 and the 94. Uh, he's going to be starting uh, outside pole. Uh, he won Talladega last year's part-time entry. And uh, Cactus King making his first CCS start since 2022 after the incident, I guess you could call it. Um, he's going to try to redeem himself, starting right behind his teammate, Patrick Miller. How about Pat that? Two teammates working together. Dude, Early for Sutton. Yep. Yep, it's a redemption arc for him. And then, like you said, got a couple of rookies that are doing their debut with this race season. See if they can win the big crown jewel of today's race. Yeah, Patrick Miller being one of those rookies. Uh, that okay run in, C uh, in Smos. Uh, almost won Hawkins Glen, but didn't quite get the job done. So we'll see how he does here in the CCS and see if he can do anything different. Sure, but Not only that, Mr. Raw Pace is also making his debut into the Cup Series. Yep, switching over Good to Toyota. Frank. And uh, it's got Gallagher. It's a primary yes. sponsor. Yeah, well, Frank I, can, I can say there's a lot of nice looking schemes here. Hopefully, none of them get damaged or beaten up. Hopefully not. That would I would stink, honestly. I guess we didn't really talk too much about our pole sitter, but uh, could he f go forth? I uh, got to change the last name on the thing. Uh, starting pole here. Uh, he started his own team, Go Forth Motorsports. We're gonna try to go go places. Isn't that my team owner? Yep, David Don's team owner. His, uh, David Don Pace and Avery running Go Forth Motorsports. I will. I will. Uh, I will try. I will try not to be biased, but if he pays me extra money, then maybe. Dang. Okay. Oh. Moving on. I give credit to Cody <laughs> by being another owner slash racer. That's pretty much of a big step for him. See how that pays off. Hey, Tony Stewart's done it and won a championship for his own team. Yeah. Actually, got so a few, you can never know. A few drivers that is that true. do that. Actually, most of the drivers in this field are that way. Um, get the command of the engines in about 10 seconds. One of our favorite parts of motorsports. Go to TV1 for that. Drivers, stop your engines! And has been given. Oh, that command was great, but I don't know if it's as good as Kevin James' command. <laughs> 60 laps here. Last year we ran 50. This year we're going to do 10 laps more. See how it goes. If it goes bad, um, I am going to be sad. But uh, if need be, I have double file restarts on. If need be, we'll turn them off if it becomes an issue. Um, again, 60 laps. We'll see how it goes. Let y'all call it from here. Uh... All right. Well, they're coming off. They're coming off the final turn. Ready to go green. This is pretty exciting. The start of a new season. Wouldn't you say so, Dark Rain? Oh, more definitely. As the green flag waves in the air, the start of the race at Pocono. As uh, people are already on the inside, making things three wide, trying to get some moves early on. Ten of Patrick Miller back there, making it three wide with uh, John yeah, that, Burge. That's that's exactly what I was looking at. Looks like he got. Looks like he got loose there. Yeah, they put cactus in the middle of the sucker hole. I don't know how to call it. Yeah, still well, fresh. No Might not have a great start there. Car Salamander going to take advantage of that. Ooh, a little Sorry, bit is of that a car sponsored Ooh, by Blade? Blade. a little bit into cactus, but that ends up is, saving it. That is indeed a car sponsored by Blade Blade. 
A simplified is, version of it for Jesus consistency. Christ. It's actually one of Dark X Reigns cars for Brit Crown Jr. <laughs> yeah, that's Rob Crown Jr. So doing his best start so far. Right, Rev is in the team. That's lap one. Yep. Uh, new season. We have a new le Oh, never mind. That looks like, uh, <laughs> surprisingly enough, part time driver uh, Jet64 gonna lead lap one. He's shown some speed. When you, have, when you have a sponsor like Top Gear, what else would you expect, though? Yeah, it hasn't you really performed it. so much in Smos. Got Top Gear uh, for both series uh, joining on as well. Be interesting he's to see shown, how he does. He's showing speed like he has Jeremy Clarkson in the car yelling power at him. That's just a little bit of reference for, uh, for people who watch Top Gear. I'm going to keep an eye on the standings on the back just in case you have any accidents. Or anything I need to look I at. I haven't seen Top Gear, but I'm sure it's pretty much enjoyable. Uh, I can tell you the British version is probably the best one, the way you want to go to watch it. Maybe start after season two or so when they make the change and add James May. Yeah, probably so. Oh, Cody's gonna make his move for the lead. Battle for lead once again. And it's at the bottom. Top top runs gonna make. I don't think you can hook it though. Looks so like they don't have enough momentum. Top gets more of a momentum. Maybe uh go for a pass if you want to in the tunnel turn, just a quick one. Like a German I gotta say, I love here. that reference. Gotta say, I love that Ooh, reference. Slides Ooh. it in deep. Ooh. Okay, okay maybe. A little bit of a bump towards the maybe, quarterback battle. Maybe that don't go for a for... pass in the <laughs> Yeah, I love that. Ah, oh. It's going to allow that 94 to pull away just a little bit. He's trying to make a move on Cody. We're going to get a little bit of a trap up with a number 64. Shangle. Road tracing or Road Terrier e Racing entry. We'll soon come to find there are some weird team names in this league. Yeah, I've already learned that after the Smosh race. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Oh, team name of the Kanye West. What? <laughs> and I believe. <laughs> yeah, some weird sponsors. <laughs> what about Kanye West? Yeah, there, yeah, there was a Kanye West car that almost got announced for Roach Racing, and with, with their move oh, to Toyota God. that uh, was canceled, they decided to stay with Dodge, which, right, we'll see how that goes. Yeah, that's kind of comes with that little bit of alliance. Are you, uh, are you sure it didn't get canceled because Toyota found out there was going to be a car sponsored by Kanye West? Good point, good point. Uh, but speaking of both Roach Rare E racing cars in the top 10, I, I don't remember if there was any, well, they're training right now. But I'm not sure if there's any more um, Roach Rare E racing cars in the field because I don't remember if there were any rookies for them this year. Well, there are three or f I don't know how many. It was like three or four Roach Rare mm -hmm. racing. I think it's a full full down of their team, so. Doing a purge back there. Yeah, it looks like these guys. It's kind of weird how they're drafting up like that. I'll have to. Right. Make sure that doesn't repeat it. Got a little bit of a side by side action going on though, but it what looks like everyone's taking into the draft. Yeah, uh, keep a note. I could have maybe moved the difficulty up a little bit more. Uh, I think maybe 105, but I kept it 102 just to make sure they weren't wrecking a whole bunch. They're they're, they're trying right. to pass. Success so, uh, is hit or miss. What's what's this guy's name in the five? As uh, Santi Messi. Is he related to Leo Messi? I have no idea. Okay. Maybe a distant cousin, you never know. Is uh, I'm, I, my IQ is going to show a little bit here. The Xbox car on the inside. Yeah, the, the 81, that is Drummer Chick. Drummer Chick 81? Is, is, is it getting one through the draft. Yep. Is it actually I believe that is Crasher the third. Yep. Uh, actually, no, we're yeah, personally, him so yes. So yeah, really wide. Almost, Almost three wide. wide. Yep. A little actually, bit of bumping and grinding. But so far, they saved it. Yep, oh German Chick 81, 2021 Jazz 500 winner, right in front of her, Sammy Box in 23, the 2021 Jazz 500 winner, and Barney Thresher right there, the 2000, or last year's regular season points champion. Got a is lot of good drivers in the top 10 right now. Is that a car sponsored by Twisted Toe from YouTube? Yep. That is uh, Roach. Nah, not, I don't, I was just watching them a little bit ago, I mean... They have their they're a good reaction channel. They have some wild takes, that's for sure. But they're still a good reaction channel nonetheless. <clears throat> and what that's going on, I think Cody's trying to pass for the lead. Yeah, we'll see if it's successful this time. <laughs> we know that top line is very OP. Jacob Shingle tried going low there. It may At come down to pit right. stops here before we start seeing any uh Ooh, big slide oh. there. 
Now I'm worried one of these guys are going to try to make a pass on the inside. They're going to slide up and it's going to be a pretty bad wreck. Yeah, especially with how close the race right now with this package. Whoa, big oh, slide there. Like that. Just, like that. just like that. Dripsy Scheib has four wins to their name the, in the past. Or actually, it might be more than that. But uh, I mean, they've been consistent. Sliding it deep. Get around Jacob Shangle. Might actually work if they can get a good run and get entry into one here. Give it up, baby. Give it really be a little bit aggressive, but you're gonna need a little bit of a drafting help. Yep. We, we, might have a, we might have an attempt pass for the lead right here. We'll see if it can work. Again, that bottom lane just isn't quite working as as well. Oh wow, big send. Oh, that oh, 54. Big. Oh he oh. sent it! So oh. three wide. And a three wide for second. Big send. I don't think, I don't think Dripsy the is to do that. Dripsy is cooking right now. They are not holding back anything right now. Looks like, looks like they did hold back there a little bit, but I'm telling you, they got to be aggressive to make the pass with the for position. If you if you uh, look back to that, I don't think. What did you say their name was? Dripsy is that the fifty four? Yes. Yeah. If if you look back at that, I don't think Dripsy meant to do that. I think they went for it, and then uh, I believe that is the sixty four next to them. They were behind them, and they actually pushed them through the corner. I think there's no way you able to pass. Yeah. Whilst that happening, the 54 did lose a spot to the 64, which they tested worked really hard a, a lap before to get that spot. May have used up their stuff a little bit as they aren't as close now. <laughs> Big sins in that turn two. Gotta say, it's some competitive racing going on. Very. Cody is trying, but he doesn't have to run to uh, complete the pass with the lead. Angle might have a run here for a second. He's going to go for it. Yeah. Uh, just didn't quite get that exit. I don't think he's going to be able to get it done. He didn't get that exit run. You just said get her done. Mal Sadly, he don't have any draft help as well, but he's going oh, to he, send it though, into turn number one. There. Yeah. A little bit of so can he hook out. it? Nope. He did a little bit. You just That outside is just very fast. Yeah, he's going to get a run on that 94 a little bit here, see if it can do anything. Dripsy trying to get past on the high side, but here he goes down him. low. He's maybe, thinking about uh, it. Maybe give him a shot entering the corner here, a, bit, a little bit of payback, hopefully. A little bit of shot. Maybe a little bump from Drummer Chick will help him get the pass, but not close enough. <clears throat> As I say, they get a good run to the tunnel turn, but when they get to turn number three... Yeah. Pretty much knows the tail. Yeah, I think at this point, I think the top eight or so are kind of starting to show their... Or actually, top seven, I would say, are kind of starting to be the dominant cars oh. at this point. Here comes a pass the lead. There goes Good Cody. Stick. Oh, he doesn't... Did he get a little help from... Big yeah. yeah, Again, that top Big lane, Shango, very OP. But... Yeah, you can... Here comes... Uh... What's his name? Drizzy? Yep. We welcome yeah, Bobby Drizzy. Isaac to the booth. Here we go. Hello, hello. Drum check right behind Drizzy. Gonna maybe push. Oh, oh might go three wide here. Actually. Oh, this might cause trouble. Oh, it Move Shangle up the track Ooh, big time. Close but to three wide, but. Thinks better of it. This might actually help. Shangle slide we got up. Got a battle for the lead and battle for third. See if it can stick. <laughs> That's not, he's gonna get a little bit of a draft help, though. Yeah, that 94 is really cooking right now. 60 was able to stay side by side through that entire straight, though. We'll see what. I don't think he's gonna. Uh, yeah, that's 94 got a really good exit there. Yeah, unfortunately, at the exit, the high link got more momentum. And Juicy's clear of Shangle. But it looks like that uh, 54 is gonna go to that inside once again. He's gonna try to start shooting it again. Whoa. Whoa. Like, Juicy definitely has the pace. Yeah, he's definitely did... good. Where did uh, the 59 come from? That's a good question. Oh. <laughs> what was that Thresher? Was Thresher, if he's thinking about making it through one. Yeah, everyone else just knows that top line is very good. They're, they go off to the top on exit, get that exit speed. I'm noticing right now these guys in the top eight battling it out more and more, and they're letting more people catch up and get into the battle. Yeah. Start to see some gaps in the mid pack, nothing too crazy. Whoa, Big's in there. Yeah, mostly we saw by side, it's through the side draft, so it's not. 
you know, I think at this point we may have green flag. We will have green flag. We'll have to. They'll have pit stops at one point. Um, if we stay under green, it'll be green flag pit stops, which will make it a little bit. Oh, shingle, shingle. Sending it deep. Move them, move them up track. Yeah, these two right here, neck and neck, all race long. But uh, yeah, they might have a little bit of a. Uh... A little bit of a rivalry going, a little bit of yeah, a rivalry right now, going on right now. I, I was trying to say, I didn't want to say the word rivalry though. Like maybe something going after one each other right now. Yeah. My English isn't too great either. <laughs> it's actually letting the top two pull away a bit. Mostly a boxing match at this point. Filling each other out. <laughs> well, if, if you ask a moon car, he'll just yell, we have a beef. A 94 <laughs> car, very strong right now. Of, uh, yeah, I was, was going to bring that up. Um, what did you say their name was? Jet 64. It's how Jet go by. 64. You said they are a part timer, correct? Correct. This is uh, what? Uh, which team? Uh, PS Motorsports. Yeah, I'm. I'm just thinking right now. If Jet 64 can somehow pull out a win out of this race, uh, do you possibly try to go full time with this ride or no? I be I be honest. He's a prospect. He uh, won last year. It's same. Same thing, uh, part time. Talladega won in a three wide split, and uh, he's got cup speed. But when it comes to, oh no! Well, can we see three wide for oh, the lead? This, this might call it. There we go. go. I'm gonna just. Uh... Be... Ooh. No. Oh, shuts the what door. Cody Ford shuts the door quick. Unfortunately, it allows the 94 to once again pull away. 60 does not want to risk it. Drifty got the moves. Sure. Give him credit for that one. But yeah, it looks like we lose Bobby Isaac there. I guess he wasn't. Oh, gonna, gonna, gonna send it in there. Gonna send it in the deep. Oh. Yeah, he knows. Yeah, I, I think moving cars up the track, <laughs> as aggressive as it may seem, is might be the strat here. here. I'm oh. telling you, it's the only way to make a move. Yep. 54 was a little bit lenient on the 60 here. Didn't want to kill him, so. I feel like this is exactly what the 94 wants to see. Yeah, exactly. This yeah, is yeah, yes, he loves to see this. Yeah. Because the more he battle for a sec, and the more he gets to pull away little by little. Yeah, there's a little bit. Of, there's <laughs> actually quite a bit of draft at this track. What more than I would have expected, especially for a track that you wouldn't expect to have draft. But oh, look at that top run, Sammy in a oh. box. On merit gets third. What a run. Holy cow, Sammy in a box. What a run on the top. He's going for second. He's making his move to the front. Oh, he's gonna send Good it. Good old here. Sammy, he's at it again. Oh, maybe a bit deep. He's gonna run Cody up a little bit. Sammy can get it done. Uh, now, again, granted, I know they're only third right now, but they have a possibility of, uh, I, I want to say, first driver to win uh, at least multiple season openers in the history of this series. But, uh, yeah, it's still in third. Still a lot of racing left to go as so well. So far, the top five is Chevy, Ford, Chevy, Chevy, and Dodge. Uh, I think we're a quarter of the way through at this point. A long way to go. And Maybe they will have rank flag pit stops at one point. Stops. They're not even next to each other, and you can see them sliding up the track. I feel like they are starting to lose some more grip. Those tires are starting to wear. Especially those cars have been sending it. I don't know. They might still have some better speed in their car than what we give them. We're, we got some single file a bit here. A little more spread out. These cars are starting to use up their stuff. There's so gonna make send it. Yeah, he's gonna send it. I would say though, being in a single line also saves on fuel, except for the leader at least. That's true. The leader has had some instances of pulling away. Very odd. <laughs> well, he was pulling away, but Cody's tracking him back down. Little by little. Oh, Dripsy did not get a good entry there. the third is between Dripsy and Sammy in the box. Yeah, Dripsy did not have a good corner. They lost two spots in one corner. Lost the momentum, and now he's going to do the old crisscross. Big send here. He's going to go along Cody. Crossover. That gives him room. It's going to cost him a little bit here on this next entry of this corner. Oh, he still has a car behind him. Ooh. Ooh. What a send by Dripsy. Angle starting to find his way more into the top five again. Trying to cook up here. Or sorry, top three, not top five. Yeah, top five most all the Yep, three wide for third. Oh, that's going to be interesting. Ooh, 
Sammy does not. Oh, oh I'm telling you. Almost. Ooh, that almost went ugly. Daniel's going to get a huge run here. Look how many spots Dripsy lost from that. Yeah, he had a bad guy that one. Otherwise, he would have wrecked the whole field. Well, big one by Shangle. You know, he's not afraid to send it. I'm going to try to get back up here. Yeah, more than Dripsy. It's pretty much been the 60 and the 94 up here this entire run. It's, it's just when you think the 60 is going to get overtaken, uh, they, they don't. Yeah, I think the same will happen here off of this corner here. Uh, 60's got yeah, a good, I think the uh, high lane does have more momentum than the low lane. Yeah. Well, one of the problems is a lot of people trying to make their pass to the inside, depending on what pit stops are. If uh, people make a pass to the inside at a time, uh, someone who might want to enter pit road might not be able to. Yeah, that is an interesting thing to point out. I could throw out a yellow. That would throw things way off, way out of cycle. Right at this point, uh... <laughs> Big thing right now is... We close to one, but at this rate, will we ever have a caution? I don't know. I don't know. Big thing I'm noticing, though, is that track position is key, so that could pick a play in strategy if Shangle slides up again. Man, Jeff Jordan there. That was a close one. Jordan, I haven't, haven't talked about oh, him too 59, much. 59 sent it. See, he was in the top 10. He was actually able to clear the 23 there with that move. Uh, doesn't slide up to... Conf well, uh, I was thinking about it. I think he did slide up there in front of the 23 to clear him. Yeah, uh, clear. He did make that spot where... Yeah, 54 also cleared the 53, but again, that, uh, 54 uh, has a terrible turn one. Yeah, really bad exit. I don't know, I feel like at this point right now you gotta play the waiting game. I have Be to. patient. Ooh. Top three pulling away a little bit right now. Yeah, I feel like you can definitely tell that this wait, top wait, three wait, is probably wait. the class of the field. Okay. Pretty much clean air, mostly pays off. So far, top three knows the tail. Battle exactly for fifth. Up. That gap getting a little bit bigger now. Between uh, fifth and sixth. Jet went up a little high, so they're going to help out Cody a little bit. But without help, he's not going to get it. As we look at the board, Jeff Jordan. They battling against Roach on his outside. Might be able to him. I believe this is a battle for fifth or sixth. Uh, tenth, ninth. Yeah, ninth place. Got a ninth. Okay. Ooh, four two could have a big run here. There you go, clear. Yep, Jeff Jordan definitely gets a clear. Then right behind him is the nine. Um, looks like. The nine there's is... a battle for the lead. Oh, that's fireball. Oh, dude! <sighs> oh, that was a... oh we got a battle for the lead. Angle almost made it three wide into one. Yeah, they've been trying that three wide, just they keep getting cut off. Well, that was a 59 to get a run on the top, but I think a 64 is going to get that entry into the second we got, corner. We have multiple cars battling for these top spots right now, but that 94 is still able to hold it. Yeah, he's it's clean right now. He for gets rookie, to control... For a rookie in a part-time schedule, that's, that's impressive. Man, just imagine, first first driver to win the... Oh, wow, three wide right now for fourth. They have it to hold it as well. Uh, that's going to yeah, cost him 59 a couple spots. Not going to look well for Thrasher. Yeah, he decided to back out. <laughs> At this rate in the race, still a smart move. We're not even halfway yet. Again, it's a long race. Almost halfway. Yeah, almost. Yep, 24 out of 16. Oh, he's gonna get a huge run. Guys are sunny. Twenty-three had a horrible exit. Oh, here, ooh, look at this run. I'm gonna probably oh, dive down boy. to the inside right about here. See if he can, if he does it, or if he saves up the stuff. Um, maybe not enough of a gap Might be a to get in there. Case, yeah. Keep it clean. Um, top five right now. These this top five is very interesting. And again, the Jet sixty-four, not even four points. So we could see the first winner of this season be a non-points driver. I mean, uh, Jet's doing so good that I might even just consider giving him full time, even if he doesn't win. Yeah. 
Yeah, he'd be a prospect for next year for sure. You think what Athena had to say about that? Yep. Hopefully, we have a better. We're going to go low against Cody. Yeah, again, I don't think it's going to stick that oh. top lane, especially in the turn two and turn one. I think. Very OP. I think oh, Shango almost. They're going to lose a couple more spots. Shango almost actually got on the apron there. I, I think he did get on the apron. That's gonna. Yeah, he definitely got loose. Test apron and. Uh, I'll just look Fifty-four looking for a second. Like I've said it a few times already, that 50, that 60 is very good at defending that second spot, but offense, they just don't have it. Just slide them up here and you might be able to get it. Nah, they're not going to do it. They're going to need some teamwork to get around the 94. Not exactly any right now looks like. teammates per se up here. Let's so remove some manufacturer and alliances with the 59 and the 60. That's about it. Maybe the 23 and the 54 might help, but let's see. I swear to God, I thought that screen said 27 like a lap ago. Uh, Boy, Thrasher thought about going through a Y, but he thought better of it. Ah, I think he ran out of room. <laughs> can't, go, can't go too low. I'm like Fox at the Clash, miscalculating the laps. <laughs> oh, well, I don't know if it was just me. It looked like that 54 got loose or something. Hey, they're clear though. Yeah, rear end got a little... Well, sideways there. I don't know what that was. A little bit of a fish tail. He's able weird. to wheel it at least. A little weird. Hang on tight. Or these cars are hard to handle. Yeah. Especially now since we're going with the lower wing instead of the small spoiler. <laughs> got rid of the yeah. cat wing. Wasn't too popular. Got wang. loaded off. Looking for a second once again. Probably the worst time to go to the inside. Yeah, again, that top that top line is just so, especially in this corner right here, turn one and two, you can't make that more corner work. Cause I that, think your best your best bet is probably to just ride that top around that whole turn one, and try to get enough momentum to send it in there in the tunnel turn. See if they commit. Yeah, gotta get you a good run off the high side. Sixty got to run. Uh, Ninety four blocks the bottom. Mm -hmm. Oh, it makes room. Anyway, oh, looking but... for lead. Here comes Cody. I don't think he's gonna do anything. But, but... unfortunately, without any draft help. I don't know, he has that 54 behind him. Let's see. stay behind him and make anything happen, though. Will Dripsy give him a nice oh. draft? Or no, uh -oh. he decides to go three wide. I don't, uh -oh. think, I don't even think they're going to stay side by side at this point. Oh, three. Well, nope. Nearly three wide for the lead. Yeah, 54 doesn't have enough. If, if the 54 doesn't want to lose the spot, they might have to slide up. Yeah, 54 get a huge run there. Oh, Cody had to get on the. Yeah, he had to yeah, let off there. Might have to slow down there for a little bit. Look how close they are to each other's bumpers, though, for third and fourth. Gypsy's gonna Another go down low against second. Cody. He sends it. A little bit of a fishtail, but he's able to stay side he's, by side with him. Yeah, his tires are wearing out. We're starting to see more fishtailing in the corners. Oh, wow, look at that entry there. Nice they, entry. Great entry. Yeah, just gotta hit the brakes big time. Great corner there. You gotta say, give him a for at least trying to get the pass for the lead, but depends on who wants it more. And right now, Jet is Ooh, basically the class of the field. Oh, Ooh, nice. it. oh that's bit of an right. error there by Thresher. Yeah, he lost a ton of time in that that move. That was a big breaking there. I don't know. I don't think he was expecting Ripsy to slide up like that, uh, entering the corner. <laughs> One of these times or another, it, it seems like they may end up. Someone may hook someone hook someone's bumper sooner or later, or starting to approach it's halfway. It's gonna happen eventually. The question now is when is that fuel window? Oh, uh, looking for a pass to lead again. Again, I don't think there's enough. Enough really. Unfortunately, Cody don't have any draft help. Uh, help get past Jet. Yeah, no, he, he might, he's not even there anymore. Yeah, didn't have any any exit speed. Let's try to send it deep, but that apron, it's tight. I would say it's a, I'll leave an according in effect that's going on. I might have a big run here. Side by side, oh, yeah. but He's I don't know if it'll Oh, what a move crossover a bit yeah. there. He didn't waste no time getting down there. Doesn't got no draft though, so he's going to have to send it deep. Unfortunately, he doesn't have any help, but he does he wiggle will. in next to Cody. But it's oh, going to get uh, Shangle a little bit of a run. Shangle, Shangle can make it three wide here. Could, will he? Ah, uh, I mean, he couldn't. 
<laughs> it is the break out of it. Some Dana in the top <laughs> ten. Did not expect that. He just currently went past Jeff Jordan. Or uh, the forty-two. Dan, I don't, oh, he don't go by Dane Silla in here, but online racing. Oh, Daniel, Daniel Chang Don't do a Changle. Don't do a Changle. It's for me. He's going to do it. Oh. It's for grass. Ah, that grass. And it hit the brakes. That's going to slow him down a little bit. That's going to slow him down. Yeah, he's going to lose. He's going to get that high lane of big run. He might lose another spot here to the 42. Yeah, 42. Gift Jordan. Yep. Yeah, get around him. So, we're halfway now. Uh, the, like I said, question is, when is that fuel window going to open? If uh, It may already be open. Be a matter yeah, of I feel like these drivers might just be waiting to see the first person dip off, waiting for the opportune time. Pretty cool to see Jim Jordan in the top five as he made his way back from where he started. I'd be pretty mad if they don't pick, cause like, it's sixty lap run, what gives? But uh, maybe on lap forty-three. You might have to mess with the. Uh, you might have to mess with the uh, what's it called? Strip thing. You mean the fuel thing? Time yeah, stamp type that's one. Yeah, yeah, it's just ionizing. I, don't uh, I think Jordan's gonna lose. Her. Jordan's gonna lose everything he just gained. Yeah. Yeah. Better than catastrophic in the game. At this point, if the game crashes, I still have the video, so I take results from the ticker for uh, ah. if the game crashes. But I did have a freeze there, so it, it didn't crash, but I didn't have a freeze there, and it was a little, a little worrying. Two, uh, two by two for second and third. That looks like it. All four. Again, I just don't think everything's going to stick. Oh, big send. This might actually work here. Oh, Hold on, we got some speed. pitting, and that's the leader. The leader oh, is yeah, pitting. pitting. Leader pitting, is pitting. Pit on he, lap number 32. He's the only taker, too. That That's this, interesting. This might actually be a perfect call here. I don't know. He doesn't got, got draft, and draft has seemed to be the biggest call, but... He might not need it, though. This could be a big undercut, because now people might have to slow down avoid hitting each other in pit road. Fair point, fair point. We'll see how this plays out. Uh, I hate to say it, but first we change the race. Um... Huh. I guess you can say pros and cons of this decision. What about uh, Slumdan in the 63? Rook, one of the rookie class. Man. Uh, Slick's Flame. He's, he's a real second now. I know uh, there was only one car that pitted, so he got up to at least, you know, fourth. Or we'll we'll someone else pit. Let's like see who else will pit. Oh, we got oh, more. He four slows down a lot. I Shangle. think Shamble's Shangle yeah, just... may, uh... Shangle's gonna pit. We got a couple more behind him. Yeah, yeah Shangle... we got more pitters. Yep, uh, again, Cody Ford is going to lead a lap. That's going to be a two-point bonus for leading a lap. All right, uh, I got a few pitters here. A whole lot. Led by Jim Sherrill. Let's just see how that 94 comes out. Yeah, 94, uh, he's back out on the track. I want to see how this works out for him. And going to go back Curly to Cody Currently last, but... At this the point... The thing is, he will have fresher tires. Yeah, at this point, they pit, the rest. they'll make it to the end. That's will split up the field a ton. It's going to come down to oh, this skill. Definitely will. This is where you, if you want to be like... 42 might have to stay out here. Yeah. I don't know. Hopefully there's no wrecks coming into pit road. If there is, it's a yellow, and that changes everything. Oh, boy. Uh, it looks box. like uh, if he can get in the line here... Yeah, looks, like, looks like a lot of cars pitting this time. It might be everybody. Good. That is, that's a lot of them. People stay oh, out. We got some that stayed out. We got yeah. two of them. We have two. Yep. Uh, this is and a battle for a lap lead. And Mari Yoko. Yep, Yoko versus Natawi, but Natawi got the lap, so that's a two point bonus for Natawi, but he's going to lose. He's actually going to lose a spot here with 51. Got a really. Had a lot of speed coming and uh, had to lose that momentum. You, uh, yeah. you don't mind if I ask to cut to the 30, 94 again, do you? Uh, yeah, we can go ahead and do that. Well, yeah, how will I lose the first uh, lap? Uh, he's by himself. By himself, yeah, that's interesting. We'll see how it goes. He's still gonna gain a couple of positions, though. Currently in last, but he does have pressure tires. Oh, he came out ahead of the 64 and the 81, 50. A lot of those guys, he came out ahead of. Did he, was he oh, able to? I don't know if he was able to. Oh wait, wait, there he is, in 29th now. There, there, that, yeah, he oh, passed him out. Look at that! Ooh, what yeah, a great hit right there. I told you the undercut will work, and yeah. now he's gonna have a big run because he's going to be on the high side out of one. Yep, the rest of the cars pit, I believe. Uh, actually, no, I think the 48 probably have to get this lap but here, too. Where is Jacob Shangle? Uh, he was behind that other pack. He actually lost a few spots. 
Uh, that, the field well, hasn't the refreshed yet. The timing hasn't refreshed yet, but we'll see how this goes. I think the 21 had a pretty bad pit stop because he's way off. Or, oh, he's pitting this oh, time. He's... Okay. Uh, it looks yeah, like... Uh, he's, he's staying on the left. Uh, I think... Yeah, not a we've led that lap. Who's going to lead this lap is the question. I think it's going to be... Uh, I, I don't know. Hard to say. It's going to be the 48. Probably going to be one of the... Probably, I think yeah, 94, 48. but... 48 left lap. That looks like it. I guess you're correct. Yeah. I want to see this gap here. Big gap. Little yeah, gap. all right. Well, uh, whoever's watching this or listening to this commentary, uh, I am accepting hirings as the crew chief. I told you this strategy was going to pay off. Sure enough, it did. <laughs> For now, Big gap. Is, but... Big gap. I'm telling you. The I gap think... is going to shrink. Uh, I don't know. If we stay oh, green, I though. think. If we stay green, I think this strategy might have helped them win this race. Oh yeah, 100%. Question is now is where's everyone else at? Twenty-four will be the back end of this pack. He's gonna—he might lose his draft here, but <laughs> back into this oh pack. yeah, a little bit of again masterclass by this 94 Jet 64 outsmarted the field, out strategized the field. This is a PS Motorsports entry. Uh, he's. Not made so many starts compared to these guys, and he's showing who's boss right now. Definitely a good cut prospect for 2025, for sure. Man, prospect? If he wins this race, he's already going to have two wins. That's true, that's true. We mean prospect. If he's winning a race like this, you gotta you gotta get him full-time as you can in the middle of his prime or something. Now, there's a lot of guys in this game who don't have one win. Shrinking, though. Yes. You know it might have paid off, but... The question is... Uh, <laughs> I I don't know. It, it's draft versus tires. I I think it's what's going to come down to, and also line placement and approaching distance. It's just going to be a lot that's going to come it down could also to. The, see, the reason I think this is going to pay off because if those uh, people in the pack behind them there try to pass each other, they're just going to lose time. Uh, Twenty-one uh, was heavily off sequence. Well, I think. Hopefully, the guys behind him have fresher. Oh, oh yeah, something's going on with the twenty-one here. Something's he's... wrong with uh, Larry Crown Jr. He is... he has problems. Yeah, he is heavily off sequence. He, uh, he keeps. It looks like he's a... gonna have to. Yeah, that might be engine damage chat or something. Like chat button. It looks like uh, you went to pit road once. I don't know. Actually, I think you went to pit road twice. I think you went to pit road three times. I think he did one twice. Uh, he's, he's slow. He's very slow, yes. Yeah, he's definitely not looking good. Keep an eye on him. He is actually losing getting speed. Out of the way. He's, he's, he's getting out thing. of the way. He's trying to get off the track. Looks like there might be another car up there having issues as well. The 10 of uh, Patrick Miller. Two cars having issues. Could this be reliability issues? It looks like he, I, I, I may be crazy. Well, no. I was going to say flat tire because it looked like it was kind of down, but... It's hard to say. Uh, they're the only two. Oh, they have damage. Yeah, what happened? They have damage. What happened there? He does have the up. On his right side, he does. Let's see when this happened. Pit road incident? Question mark? Oh, they're coming down the pit road together. This... He has damage there. Yeah, the no, he not there. I feel like they, they, oh, they, they, they hit each other, 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 other on pit road. Yeah. They hit each other yeah, on pit now, road. Now, right? now they're both. He's going to. Hang on. Yeah, no, he's done. No, no fuel. Oh, no fuel. Patrick, yeah, that probably messed up his fuel cell. So same for the 21. Well, the he same didn't... thing happened to Rebel Crown Jr. I mean, they're the two that made contact on pit road. I wouldn't be surprised. It was on pit road, though, so I don't think it'll warrant a yellow. But... The fact that he yeah, ran out of gas. Well, not on pit road. But... Logically, the 21 shouldn't have had any fuel issues. Uh, I don't even know if that's what issues he's having. No. Oh, oh he's... I guess it's a tire. Must be some moment of tire, I guess. He might be coming back in to repair that damage you got from the hitting the 10. And Miles will get some fresh tires while he's yeah, at Yeah, he's getting four oh, tires. Oh, they caught him. They caught 964. I told you that guy was closing, but the problem is, can they make the pass? Yeah. That's going to be another issue. Yeah, we got a good gap As between, like, uh, to... the 42 and the uh, 89. That's about, what is it, 20 uh... laps to go? Uh, just about, yeah, 20 laps yeah, to go. About, time yeah, about 20 laps to go. It looks like 21's oh, going to keep going. Here. Yeah, 21's going to keep going. He's going to try. Look like he's back up to speed. He's not going as slow now. So well, he's going to be a slight... Oh, Maybe oh, he can oh, that's, be a factor in it. That's an issue. Oh, he's going to make the 94 weave and wire. The 94th ball. 
All right. Oh. Um, Sadly, uh, Cody couldn't take advantage of that. As Ronnie Con Jr. trying to get out the way. Yeah, going high. That was interesting, Cody. Uh, yeah, I guess yeah. he was. I guess spotters oh. called him to move high, so I guess we'll go. Can, uh, can we check? Can we check the right side of that 94 somehow? Uh, right side. Uh, well, we'll see this. The right side of 94. Oh, I don't see any damage. It looked like yeah. he might have gotten a piece of the wall when patching up to the 21. If anything, it would have been much. I think it's on moderate damage. I could be wrong. It might be unrealistic. I know damage is on. I think you have it on realistic. Probably moderate. It might, it might but be it realistic. Is, but it's not affecting them, though. There it goes. As we see Thrasher trying to get around Cody, but he's had to get back in line. Yeah, they're not really closing these gaps now. It's really just all coming down to skill at this point. A 94 really had the perfect strat, like, like uh, David said. He made it work, and uh, he's got the lead now. now these, guys may have a, these guys may have a few fresh retires, but when it comes down to draft and corner entry, I don't know. Cody got enough. loose. That's going to give room for Thrasher. Jang uh, Jangle, sorry, not Jangle. Oh, he's going to make it. <laughs> uh, I don't even think he's got. The... This is the only problem with this AC right here. They're not working together. Rich Crown Jr. So this will in work in Jet's favor. Pack. What'd you say? Uh, Merch Crown Jr. merged in behind the 81, a German chick teammate. They also have fresh retires that 21 does, so they may try to, if if it's even possible, they may try to get one or two of their laps back, or one of their laps back, or not possibly any more like that. I don't think. Oh, wow, actually a good slide there by 59, but 64 left room. Are they left? Uh, the sorry, I mean, you... technically it's the only car I lap down. Can you go back to that leaderboard? Even though we see a battle for third. Sorry? I was just asking if we can go back to the leaderboard once again. Uh, should be up right here. Yeah, I, mean, I was asking if you could, like, scroll through it again. Oh, yeah. 11 through 20. German check out the nice run. Yeah, that was really all the cars in contention. Again, the 21, three laps down. And, uh... And the 10 gonna... DNF. Yeah, the 10. That's what I was going to... Yeah, they're done. Yeah. Real issue for them. Gunther in the top ten. Apparently, out of gas. No, I'm actually. I was. I was receiving word that apparently when the when the jack dropped, the fuel line ended up puncturing or something happened when they made contact on pit road. Uh, it may have happened. Possibly when he getting now about a twenty-one. Speaking of the twenty-one, he's trying to get one of his laps back the hard way. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's not gonna do much, but. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. it may not be intentional, but if it was, that, uh, that 21 might end up seeing some payback in that 10 sometime in the future. Maybe. I uh, know, they don't really have a pass. This is really Patrick's first race with Roberts Crown Jr. Uh, it's, uh, making rivals in your debut, not really the best strat for Patrick, but, oh well. Yeah, so we're going to have, like, a Larson versus Ty Gibbs incident? I don't know. I do know this, uh, the 10 cars out of the race, only retiree from the race at this point, and they pretty much, uh, yeah, for your debut, it's not looking good. Cactus Racing Enterprise is also as a team making their debut, so. And that, not too good of a start, but Daytona is next week, and uh, even though this one, uh, eh, it's not that great, but we'll go to next week, next week will be better, and you know, Daytona is, it's always a banger. We never have bad race in Daytona. <laughs> <laughs> we battle at the beach, but well, battle for well, through one for third, but it and was. they almost. If only they could make it work, it would have been great, but unfortunately, no. I was just a little underzealous on this setup. They aren't wrecking, except for the fact that uh, they ain't really able to. It, it takes a lot of work to pass. Now it's not impossible, but it takes a lot of like right variables to pass. And again, that ninety-four <laughs> cars. And again, that 94 car just has a little bit of a car right now. Okino doesn't have much passing. But those are a fan of Rex. This is not going to be a race. This is more about strategy at this point. Yeah, hopefully next week. If you're uh, if, if you're watching this for the Rex, don't even watch. <laughs> Go watch uh, the... Uh, Demolition uh, Derbies. I, I, I want to bash on someone's league without, you know, sound like a... An, like a like a guy that's rude, but like 
I can't really think of any leagues that are like that. Actually, Chris Mack, he has a he has an offline league. If hey, you like watching Rex, don't, don't don't. I mean, like I'm not bashing on the guy, but like you know, he likes. It's not a bad thing. I mean, he, 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 that's his like style. Go of... watch. No, no. Go watch highlights of that. Uh, that one dude who got banned while Carl was racing that league. Are you talking about DSRA? Yeah, no, I'm the the one in the voice chat we were watching. Uh, I don't remember, but oh, you talking about Rob? Oh, wait, Robert Miles? No. Yeah, uh, unless Miles been socks, but oh well. You, you can see there's was, like three like, packs right now. It was this dude who Four. kept going three wide, and oh. wrecked Carl. Oh, oh, Trey Kenzie. Yeah, if you want to watch Rex, watch Trey Kenzie highlights. <laughs> Well, you heard it here, folks. <laughs> Do with that information. Well, I didn't hear the camera for tonight. <laughs> <laughs> yep. But pretty much, but, as I said, it's none of the VRX. It's all about strategy. I think at this point, just from guesstimations, I think the 60 and the 40 are the only two cars in this race, other than the 94 who's led a lap. And again, you don't get a point for every lap led like it was last year, regardless if you lead. Actually, if you lead the most laps, you do get a 10-point bonus along with that. Or actually, no, I don't think it's along with it. You get that 10-point bonus because you don't get the two... So you get 10 points if you lead the most laps, but you don't get the two points for the lap because you got the 10 points for 10-point bonus. I know it's kind so of that weird. Was actually, uh, that was actually some stuff I was going to bring up earlier. Um, and the SMOS race, you were mentioning some new things like the point system and a little bit of differences. You know, add some more dominance here and there. Uh, correct? Correct, yes. Right, so... um. Big difference here with this compared to Smos. We are not starting the season off at Daytona, so with this race, with the new points thing, you are getting to see a little bit more of who's actually going to be a better car, a better driver in these types of environments instead of a super speedway environment like Daytona early on. Right, that that's next week for this. <laughs> and well, just... I just mean like as a season opener. Sure. You're, you're going to get more of a talented winner. That's true. Not not a shot at who won the Smos race. Just saying. <laughs> yeah. I was I was only like two laps away from winning. <laughs> yeah, Craig Packers, your 2024 <laughs> Smos Daytona winner. You want to go watch that? That was a video before this that was posted. Whenever this goes up, this will go up. Uh, let's see, it'll go up Thursday at. Screw it. Doesn't matter when this video Five, comes 15, out. Just go to the yeah, channel, click the videos, click and click the uh, the small race. So, oh, here comes Dripsy. Yeah, Dripsy trying something. But yeah, I think at this point the points leader after this, I think, will be Cody Forge because he's the only guy. Uh, Grant, I know he's second right now, but he actually he's led a lap, so that's two points time. plus that. And because the '94 is not full time. Yeah, that's true. Um, which uh, they which may he end up totally being... should be if he wins this race. Even if he doesn't. Uh, I don't they know definitely what you're could. talking about. I do see different types of packs. But, man. Masterclass by the um, rookie. Does, does this league have a playoff format? Used to. Got what it did now. last season. Yeah. Uh, what is it now? It full season points, basically. Whoever has the most. Well, last year, we had the two, so we had two drivers that had four wins. Both of them got eliminated in the round of eight. Or actually, yeah, one got eliminated like, in the round of 16, one got eliminated in round of eight. It was like if they had rate wins to Daytona 500. Ago, nobody voted for the winning your end thing, so. Even then. That's okay. I, wasn't even, I didn't even do a vote on that. I was like, man, I'm tired of these rigged champions. Yeah, that was like two <laughs> years ago. Nobody, everybody voted no for the winning your end thing. And if you want playoffs, go to like Fanta Cup Series or. Uh, heck, do they even do playoffs? I, I'm not sure. Don't, don't Don't hold me on that. The only thing that gets me on that, but, uh, yeah. I'll also watch Sonic Cup Series. Yeah, yeah, go watch Sonic Cup Series, whatever they do. The videos are kind of shit, but it's okay. Yeah, it's cool down the I also want to notice series, watch. but it's only Discord live opinions, but if you know, you know. Anyways, I know this race has kind of been a snooze fest in the past few laps, but... snooze fest. Okay. I mean, you did say... But it doesn't like Ricks. It is better than having like 50 million wrecks and ending up with like five cars finishing the race. All right. 
Yeah, it would like 50 million wreck. You may as well call it really more like survival. Also, a little throwback to last season. Might as well just have your season opener. Listen, one wreck here could change everything. Yeah, lest we forget the that last season. Uh, last season we had uh, the gaming freak and uh, Bobby Isaac die in turn one. <laughs> Uh, last season, that was a horrendous wreck. Arguably the worst wreck of last Wait season. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Horrendous if, wreck? If he died, how did he show up in the, this voice chat? Did we just witness a ghost? Yeah, hey, figure your speech, man. The brother. ghost of Bobby Isaac. Oh, okay. yeah, imagine that. Now I gotta start playing Phasmophobia <laughs> while in the Discord chat. I don't even know what that is. It's a ghost hunting game. It's pretty fun. Oh, well, learned something new every day. Anyway, 94 is still leading. Got eh, seven laps to go. And uh, they are train yes, racing. Chang gonna send him in there. Chang gonna like. Uh, Holy cow! He hit the apron. Where there. what now? <laughs> Told you he did. I think Chang heard you about the train racing part. He's like, well, look like it's a job for me. To yeah. take second. Once is again, boring. Bottom oh, lane doesn't work. Bottom lane does not work. Yeah, and that 94 is gone again. Op. I'm going be honest. Side. Oh, Chang. Uh, I gotta double check his ratings after this just to make sure he's not like got an advantage. I know he's a part time guy, oh, don't matter, but no, come on, don't ruin the magic because I, I, I'm I'm not gonna ruin it if it's if it's actually there, it's actually there. But if it's not actually there, and it's just like because I messed up on the ratings, I, don't I'm not make gonna... him don't make him fail post race inspection. No, I'm not I'm not like that. If, if it happens, it, it, that's on me. I just take the L. I'm not gonna take it away from the driver because I made a mistake. That's how I do it. If if I actually mess up on someone's ratings. They keep their win. Uh, that's my mistake. They take the W. I'll take the L. He's, he's probably going to lose it here. But, um, I just realized that whole last lap, Chang will send it on the inside in turn one and stayed side by side with, uh, well, you know, the 60. Cody for, Cody go he must have heard what Zach said lap. about train race. That's probably why he did it. Yeah, like Dripsy being a little more aggressive now, more than he was earlier. Yeah. Hey, Ripsy and Shangle have been going at it pretty much all race. Uh, you could be right on that. That is true. Can we? They haven't gone all race. One retiree, that is uh, Patrick Miller, had a accident on pit road. Messed his, uh, messed up his. His fuel line got cut. Yeah, his fuel line got cut on pit road after an accident with the uh, Crown Junior. Virtual Crown Junior recovered. He's three laps down. He's actually in the front pack. Well, he's actually working with his teammate Jeff Jordan and German Chick 81. And all three, three of or, the or four Dom Patrol cars. Is he, is he working here. with him? Is he working with him, or is he holding them up? Eh, I will say thing. working with him because they're both moving slowly to the front. Well, hopefully, uh, hopefully it's the working with them part because uh, you don't want to be working against your teammates. Uh, I think Jeff jo jo Jeff Jordan. Yeah, yeah, Jeff Jordan. Jeff Jordan, I guess. It's like Jeff Gordon, but backwards. The G and then yeah, the I know. Yeah. It's messing with me right now. Yeah, I, I still haven't got it right. Jeff, Jeff Jordan's kind of losing some spots. I'll be honest, those top two have pulled away. Yep, since these guys yeah, want to stay side by side, it's, it's, Cody uh, and Jeff are like, well, uh, we'll just fight for the lead. I think his name's Gunther. Yep, Gunther and the... Or I, Gunther, Gunther, Gunther uh, however you want to pronounce it. Gunther, Gunther. Unless he starts griping at me and DMs like, "Hey, you pronounced my name wrong." I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna really worry about it. Uh, he's it's Gunther or Gunther or whatever. Hey, yeah, dude. Uh, oh, I sponsored think I had, by uh, Denny's. Denny's. How about that? Man, I saw this paint scheme get painted. Yeah, you were watching, you watched me paint this, yeah. Boy, speaking of the guy who was in Splash, you ever seen? Man, he really lost a lot. Uh, is Gunther a wrestling fan? No idea. Alright, well, that's the name of a wrestler, just Gunther. I don't know if yeah, we talked about it a lot. Getting after from him, I'll say that. Uh, what? I don't know if we talked about it a lot. The last season, we didn't have a single Toyota in the field. This year, I think we have a few more in la We have a f we have a few. Uh, Rick Wick Wick Rare Racing. It's kind of like Gift Jordan kind of deal. Wick Rare um, <laughs> Racing. Uh, Bird is back. Uh, he's in a what Toyota the hell team. Is that sponsor? Uh, conspiracy oh, the theories. The conspiracy theories with Bird. Oh Jesus Christ! Uh, he's back uh, again. He's probably one of the most dominant drivers in this league. Uh, he's made the championship for him, uh, the Smos in his one season, and has made the uh, championship <laughs> for in the CCS in 2022. And then last season made the playoffs and had two wins. This year, already looking for a top ten in the season opener. That's Even though it is at Pocono. He is a top-running Toyota, after all. 
Anyway, two laps to go with 964 leading. Yep, 94 leading. He's uh, not quite the Grand Slam. His, uh, name, his name has 64 in it. That is true. That That is going to mess with me. Big time. 94, but 64. But his name is not in the 10, though. Oh, man. That's going to mess with me. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, <laughs> here we go. You know it's 94, but he's definitely enjoying... Either in good about it for a second. Let's get some more time to pull away. Yeah, he oh, has he has a he has a good gap right now. I think this race might be over. Also, a little nugget here. I felt like this car needed more white. So this is the only car I actually ever painted for this mod that has white sky skirts. Not like e it. not even in this field. The only car for the next gen mod I've painted that has white side skirts. It looks. I mean, good. it kind of fits though. <laughs> I will say it fits. It was coming anyway, white flag. Uh, white flag for this part-time rookie, Judge 64. Sponsored by Credit One Bank, as they usually will say. I mean, would say that, but I don't want to get copyright claims. So. Probably won't say that. <laughs> sponsored, uh, by, like, uh, some... sponsored by Top Gear. Uh, I don't want copyright. Uh, uh, let's use one of our, our first, first A fictional sponsors. Snail Man's Murder Oil, Pox Lug Nuts, or... Uh, that's all I can think of off the top of my head. Sponsored by Poken Elf. Damn, can't, probably, won't, probably won't get sued over that. <laughs> I don't know. It's not like I'm making money off this anyway. <laughs> As they're coming through the final corner in three, and there is no turn four. What, <laughs> what turn, turn four? And who would have doubted it? He led mostly all the laps. Hey, I told you. 54 wins <laughs> at Pocono. Sign this, get this man a full-time contract, and I am a great strategist because I told you this would pay off. Anyways, next week is day the Jazz what 500. What do you mean anyways? Hey, fair enough. Yeah. Next mean, week's yeah. Jazz 500. Uh, that race will also be, I think that race can be 80 laps, so prepare it's... for uh, pain if it's actually bad, so I don't know. We'll Come see on, how you they turn to see goes. anyways. This is a great win. Yeah, well, it's he not like that. It's just like I'm so forget. used. I'm so used to he, just bad races. It's just that's kind of seasoned me into like, uh, okay, moving on next week. <laughs> but, yeah. Come on, this is Zach we're talking about. Let him have it. Yeah, can, come on, part timer should be. I mean, we didn't get a pass for the lead on green, but like you said, Jet let the most laps. He gets the win, and history he, book he, has the uh, first part time driver to win the start of the season. Made a great pit strategy. Well, no doubt in that. Yep. Pit strategy, guys battling for a second. Couldn't get the pass, but it pays off in this favor. Oh, got I'm pretty sure thoughts? Jet is probably celebrating in mm -hmm. a dollar. Yep. Y'all got any last thoughts before we close off the broadcast? Uh, uh Find him to a full-time contract. Eric, you got any thoughts? Not really. Congrats to Jet leading every single lap. Everything pays off for him. He oh, may okay. want to well, think it about wasn't every single lap. Yeah, uh, Jacob. Oh, yeah, almost or, every uh, single lap, I should say. Yeah, Cody go forth, and uh, I believe not. We were able to get a couple laps left as well. But... Gotta say, a couple of good results for the guys finishing the top ten as well. So not a good result for you though. Yeah, I can say it's only the beginning. <laughs> Uh, I'm just messing with you. Uh, <laughs> all right. Oh, oh no. I, no, nothing wrong with that. I, I actually, I actually like that. Anyways. It's pretty cool. Well, uh, well before I close we'll off, see you at Daytona. Before I close off, gonna list off the top ten finishers. Jet 64, part-time driver. He's gonna win the season opener. Yeah. Cody go fourth. They're gonna get second place. Third place, Jacob Shangle. Fourth place, Barney Thresher the third. Gunther gets fifth. Sixth place is Dripsy Shibe. Seventh, Bird. Eighth, uh, Geff Jordan. Ninth, uh, Slicks Flam. Flame. Uh, I, I can't pronounce that. And then Six tenth place, the car who flipped here last year, uh, Gaming Freak. It's going to start off as Anyway, you said Cody place. Goforth got second? Yes. Oh, I'm going to yep. lose my ride. I was rooting for Jet. Yep. <laughs> Well, hopefully not. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and call it here. We'll see you next week at Daytona. And uh, thanks for watching.